The first thing I want to do is show you the wrong way to duplicate. Suppose you already have a ready-made composition and you want to duplicate it. It would seem the easiest way to press Command plus D and a copy will appear. But in this case, if we replace the content in the placeholders, then it will be replaced in both compositions. So, this method is not correct. Now I will show you 4 ways to properly duplicate a composition with independent content. Create a new composition. To make things faster, I'll add a pre-made shot from the Hyper Project by Easy Edit Studio. Let's import the content we'll be using. Go inside to the composition and add content to each placeholder. Nice. The first way to duplicate a ready-made comp is to save the comp as zip file. But, if you are working on a project with many other compositions, the first thing you need to do is delete all unnecessary and leave only one composition that you want to save. For example, I will add many different photos. Now select the layer you need, right click reveal reveal layer source and project. Choose the layer, go to file dependencies reduce project. Next, you will see a pop up window, which says that files not related to the composition you need have been deleted. They have also been removed in the project panel. Now you can save the composition as a new project. To do this, go to File Save Save as select the path and write a name for new file. Next go to File Import File and select the file that we've saved earlier. Find the layer with the main composition and open it. Go inside to the composition and change the content to another one.
As we can see here it has changed, but on this composition it has remained the same. This is perhaps the easiest and fastest way. Right click on the main layer reveal reveal layer source and project. Select the layer in the project panel and launch the plugin. I will leave a link to the plugin in the description for this video. Set the number of copies and click duplicate selected. Click OK and close the plugin. As we can see the layer is duplicated. We drag it to the timeline, go inside and replace the placeholders with other content. As we can see in the duplicated layer, the content is mostly different. The method works. The third method is perhaps the longest and the most difficult, but it works. Let's create another one of the same composition. Right click on the main layer reveal reveal layer source and project. Duplicate the layer you found and add it to the second composition. Go inside and find the path of the first placeholder. Now let's duplicate this placeholder, name it placeholder 01.1 and find its path as well. As we can see, both placeholders have the same path, which means that if we replace the content in one, it will be also replaced in the another. To fix this, duplicate the layer that is linked to these placeholders in the project panel. Then holding ALT, drag it to the placeholder 01.1 layer. You can remove the first layer. Repeat this action with the rest of the placeholders. Then replace the content in the placeholders with another one.
As you can see here, you have replaced the content, but on the first composition it has remained the same. The fourth method is suitable for those who have Easy Edit Viewer installed. In order to duplicate a composition, you do not need to use the previously listed methods. You just need to import one more composition to the timeline. It is imported clean and independent. Thanks for watching.